Reef sharks, they all like together in these little alcoves. They essentially cuddle together in big piles, which I thought was just absolutely adorable. Roca Patira, which stands for split rock. It was the most remote location I had ever been to at that point, and it was very exciting. We were literally completely surrounded by water on all horizons, no land in sight. It's a very iconic location, a bucket list dive for many, many divers. Roca Partida is particularly known as a home for white tip reef sharks. We hit the water and dive down to 80 feet. Because of the clarity of the water and the sunshine, I was able to get a really marvelous shot of the reef sharks who rest during the day. They're more active at night. But during the day, they all like together in these little alcoves on the side of the reef. They essentially cuddle together in big piles, which I thought was just absolutely adorable. Who would think that sharks liked to cuddle? They don't really sleep in the same sense that we do. It's more that they are just resting for the day. I don't know specifically the physiology of how they rest, but I am fairly sure that they don't enter any dream state like humans would. Part of it is for protection, but as far as I know, they probably just enjoy cuddling together in a big pile. As with all wildlife, you do need to treat them with respect. We did keep a reasonable distance. In general, humans are not on a shark's menu. The problem is if you do something stupid, like if you reach out and grab one or stick your camera right in their face, that's when you're going to have problems. But if you are respectful, you keep a reasonable distance, you really have no reason to be concerned. This particular dive was very new to me. It was my first time in a location this remote. It was the first time for me to see white tip reef sharks cuddling like this. I had seen reef sharks many times in previous dives, but this particular situation was completely new for me. I got what I thought were some just really great shots, and I was very pleased with what I was able to do with the final edits. Since I became a diver, my life has changed considerably. I've become so much more aware of and concerned for the state of our oceans. Part of what inspires me to share my videos is to bring awareness of the beauty that, that lies below the ocean that so many people have never experienced.